Ah, uh, Monopoly. The game that has been causing family fights and teasing since 1935. I haven't thought about Monopoly as an adult or from a business perspective. The last time I remember playing Monopoly, like really, really enjoying playing it, was when I was in my teens, uh, playing with my cousins uh, in my grandmother's garden. That also got me thinking of, I have kids, I should have, you know, memories that are more recent than that. And uh, that got me thinking about uh, why, and for two reasons. The reason, you know, as parents like to hide behind is that, oh, they're too young to play this. But the real reason, uh, if I'm being an honest parent, is that it takes a lot of patience. This game is hours and hours and hours long, and as adults, I don't think we have the patience uh, as much as before to go through this extensive game. Now, let's talk about the business takeaways from playing Monopoly. Every time you pass go, you collect 200. It's a regular income. It's the closest to a salary. That was my gut feeling, and then when I opened it up and I saw it, there's a clear indication that it's a salary. So the small accumulations of the salary that we have, we're gradually turning it into savings in terms of property uh, and, and other things. Don't hold on to cash. You can quietly keep on collecting cash without spending it. However, if you remember any of the family teasing that you used to go through is when you landed on one of their expensive properties. Community Chest is an example of an ecosystem. You interact with different members of your community, different stakeholders, your customers, your employees, your investors, your partners. Building a business involves interacting and building and engaging with the ecosystem around you. Be careful who you trust with money. Do you remember that feeling when you have a certain family member who volunteers to be the bank who handles the cash and you have doubts in their integrity? It's the same thing in business. Be careful who you trust with your money. I've been burned a couple of times where I've trusted uh, customers with a longer line of uh, credit and they end up not paying it. You learn from it and you come back from it. Product placement works. If I tell you that you were too young to understand product placement when you were watching the series of Friends, there are countless examples where Friends have a series of product placement carefully placed all the way throughout the TV series. It's part of the whole story. The last business takeaway is that patience in business is required. In the meantime, take it easy on yourself. We're playing this game for long, long hours, whether it's business or monopoly. And some moves are good and others are not. Sometimes we're strategic and tactful, and other times it's chance and roll of the dice. Take it easy on yourself in the meantime. What I do is, I know that if it's a bad day or a bad move, I know that tomorrow it's a reset, I'm gonna start over and play the game again.